Holy shit, it's fucking bright. Ugh. You know, one of the biggest lessons I've had to learn on this wild ride that is life um, is to breathe in the good shit and breathe out the bullshit. Um, you know, we have days where shit gets wild and we don't we don't know what to do with it, right? So something catches up with us, we get stressed out, things get too crazy, like we just have a bad fucking day, you know? We wake up and the world is on fire. Maybe not literally, but our personal world is on fire and we feel like there's nothing that we can do to change it. You know, everything is wrong, right? And it sucks because it can be really hard to manipulate the tools that you have in your toolbox to use to your advantage so that it doesn't feel so dire. Um, you know, and you've heard, I'm sure a lot of you that have listened to the daily motivations the past couple of days have heard me talk about having like physical jewelry or, you know, a worry stone or something that you can physically touch. One of the biggest things that, you know, um, my psych had, had taught me was the, the senses. So, um, you know, five things you can hear or see, four things you can smell, so on and so forth, broken down into the five, five senses. Um, but not everybody, I think, does very well with having certain things triggered. Um, you know, some people may do better with walking outside and being like, oh yes, I see the sky and so on. Or some people may be like, it smells like rain, right? If you like rain smell, I do. I love rain smell. Rain, leather, and, uh, and books. I love old books, like old libraries. Like I just, that's, that's my shit right there. My point though, is that be patient with yourself because it can be really hard to find the right formula to give you a little bit of a, a push to make your day better. So don't be discouraged if you're having a bad day. It's going to be okay. It may not be okay right now. It may not feel okay. You may look at me and be like, ah, oh, yes, you're full of shit, but take it from somebody who is there on, you know, a, a damn near daily basis where I have to pull myself out of it periodically. Um, and, and really try to figure out the right way to approach the day because no two days are the same for me sometimes. Some days I hear a song and I break down and I start crying and like, that's, that's it. That ruins my shit. And other days it could be the smell of something or I may just wake up and feel like crap. So you aren't alone. Keep fighting. You've got this and take care of yourselves and, and take care of the, you know, your friends and your loved ones because... You never know when somebody needs that extra hug, okay? So, bye guys.